You cannot say that you are serving them by the one who is even doing things in a nightclub. You want to try your best to respect the world. You have to respect your own world. This is the that you are looking for. That you are going to serve. But understand something that what you are doing is own, it's precious, it's sacred before God. And you are going to respect it. To be, uh, uh, to be, um, or to say it. To, to put some zeal and respect in the thing that you are going to do for the Lord because you are going to serve the Lord, not the man. Don't look at what people will tell you. Be focused on what the Lord is telling you and is telling about you. And do it with all your heart and passion for the Lord, the only true God. And that means also that you have to make you have to make sure that everything is clean in your life and you are not living any hour. This verse is important. Make sure that what you are doing, let me, let me say it this, in this, in this way. Jesus was saying, let, make sure that everything that you are doing, do everything that you are doing, people are going to praise the Lord. So that means when you are doing something and people are not praising the Lord, you are not doing the will of God. If people are insulting God because of you, you are not doing the will of God. And you have to change. Repent and ask the Lord to help you. Some of us, we are playing with the Lord and playing with the things of the Lord. This is not normal. You cannot say that you are serving them by the one who is even doing things in a nightclub. That's not normal. You want to play? You want to enjoy? Enjoy. Leave the things of the Lord. Don't mix. Don't mix. It's why in the, in the book of Revelation, John said, through the inspiration of the Holy Spirit, the one who is singing, let's him continue to sing. The one who is living according to the Holy Spirit, let's him continue to satisfy himself. We don't have to do this. Do what you want to do. Do it with passion. Only the Lord knows when he will call you, when he will judge you, when he will transform you. We don't try to do this. Look at the name of the Lord to show you the way your attitude is so good. The way God will save you, you are praying in His name. And it's why people used to say that the preacher of grace, they are praise, they are helping people to see. The more we, we it's like the more we preach about the grace, it's like giving the, the, the contract to people to see. But then because they are saved by grace, the Lord is sustaining them by grace, they can do whatever they want. And I want you please to go on YouTube and watch this video about the basis of sanctification, the difference between the flesh and the spirit. Do you understand that? When you are made by the Holy Spirit, the way you live 